Hey guys, Moshe, the electric Israeli is here, and we got uh, this amazing, amazing software update, uh, the Tesla Model Y, uh, 220, 24.6.5. Really great stuff. Let me go through it very quickly. The first one is uh, backup uh, camera improvement. So now if you put the car in reverse, you see you get this ba backup, and now you can see right and left. You can uh, cancel it if you want, but if you go to this error, you can see right, here's the right and here's the left. Great stuff, great stuff. Uh, the next thing is the dash cam viewer. Uh, basically, if you go, uh, let me just read you a little bit, in the sentry mode viewer, easier to review. Uh, they have added along with the scrubber, video scrubber, uh, to indicate movement when sentry mode event actually took place. They do uh, a red dot, you see that? So let's say you parked, and this is when the event took place, so the red dot will go there right away. Let me show you an example. So let's launch the viewer, and we can go to the menu, and we can go to sentry mode, and let's see what happened today. You see that dot over there? That's where things happen. Okay, that is when things happen. It will skip right to the dot, uh, and we can go, let's see, let's do this one. It goes, skips right to the dot, and then uh, you see this nice lady uh, next to the car uh, getting out. This is big brother, baby. <laughs> it's amazing, amazing. Uh, continuing on uh, to a tuning improvement. This is cool. Basically, uh, I'll just go right to it. Uh, if you go to your uh, podcast, here's, I don't know, I just picked Joe Rogan. Let me just do this again. No, sorry, so let me do this again. So this is the normal voice. It's the lawnmower 3.0. It's a waterproof cordless. Now, if you go here, you can speed up 125, one and a half, or two times. Now he's gonna speak much faster. Body trimmer, and uh, let me tell you something, I've been using a regular head shaver. Okay, so if you wanna hear the podcast faster, Let's see, go one and a half. I shave my head with a, you know, a hair trimmer, and then I use a... That's great. We listen to a lot of podcasts when we uh, uh, go on trip. Now, after a podcast, tuning improvement, walk away lock, uh, lock door improvement. This is great. So I we park this car in the garage always. It's it's closed in the garage. So if you don't want if you don't want it to be locked when you walk away, you can actually set up obviously in the navigation your home address so it's set set home and you can go to locks and select exclude home. All right? So you can go here, you can go to locks and then you can go down and uh you see a walk away lock on, but you can exclude home. It's great. Now it will not lock when you are when you are inside the garage. If you park your car outside, obviously you don't want to leave it unlocked. But if you do park in garage like we we are, then you can leave it unlocked. Great stuff. Um, new language now Portuguese is added on. Como vai? Tudo bom? No, I don't speak Portuguese. I just know two words. So I'm not going to care about that. I wish they, they add Hebrew for me. This is the biggest one, the cabin camera. Okay, as you know, I don't know if you can see right here above the uh, above the uh, 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 rear view mirror. Right here, there's a camera. Now you can enable it. Let me read this to you because this is big time, big daddy. Help Tesla continue to develop safer vehicles uh, by sharing camera data from your vehicle. This update will allow you to enable the built-in camera above the rear view mirror. If enabled, Tesla will auto automatically capture images and a short video clip just prior to a collision, God forbid, or a safety event. So this is in a, this is going to take an image before if, if collision happen or a, a safety event happen to help engineer develop safety feature and the enhancement in the future. As usual, we you can adjust the data sharing uh, performance by tapping on control, safety and security, data sharing, allow cabin camera analysis. I'm gonna show you how to do that if you choose. But note, camera, uh, cabin camera images video uh, clip will not be associated with your VIN uh, to protect your privacy. So that's great stuff. That is great stuff. This is another step towards um, towards uh, uh, full self-drive to um, 
safety and security and you go down here to data sharing and here you have you know you share the driving but here you have uh, do you allow uh, us to collect uh, this data uh, this is from the cabin inside the cabin if I say yes it is collecting data from the cabin and I'm going to submit all right guys this is an awesome 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 update thanks